Good afternoon and welcome to Professor Farm Town's tutorial on nine times overlapping. Uh, you're looking at my farm number one right now and I always like to show off one of my farms at the beginning. But we're going to be talking about nine times overlapping. It's an advanced course so if you haven't done the three times overlapping yet, stop here, go do that first, get used to it, then come back and do this. We're going to skip over some of the basics like uh, opening tabs and hiding things this time because you should know it by now. Uh, hiding trees and so forth. Uh, I will show you how uh, the little glitch thing where you have to plant a field and delete it and saving changes. I'll go over that once or twice and after that you won't see it anymore because I'm going to be editing those sections out so to make it a little bit shorter and more concise. So anyway. Nine times overlapping. It's not layering. It's nine times the yield of the farm on one farm. It takes longer to do, and you will need to use your 4x4 or 3x3 on your own farm. If you're working someone else's farm, you will need your 4x4. It takes, it's a lot to do, so just take your time, go through it, and it will be nice experience. Anyway, here's my farm of everything hidden, and we're going to go and go down to this lower area here in the corner. And I'm just going to do a 9x9 nine nine in this area because it's a small area and it won't take that long to show you instead of doing the whole farm, which will take forever. So anyway, we'll go down here. This is the area I was talking about. <coughs> Excuse me. And we're going to go to the plow tool here. Oh, first we're going to make sure you have nine tabs open. You see nine tabs open there. Uh, before you start this, take them all offline and you plant a single field and delete it and what this does is make it so that you can plow underneath the trees that I had planted there and the fences and everything so be nine times you start out the same way as you do it the three but three times overlapping you find an edge we're going to use this road here and the edge of the farm here and that's going to be our starting point uh, you plant one up there and you just plant it or do your fields as usual all the way to the end I'm just going to do this little section here and we're going to save pending changes and close that window and now on the second layer you're going to start out in the same position up on the top le le uh, top line after you do your single field and delete it <coughs> okay now you go up here use the same starting spot starting spot and go over one space and start from there same way that you do on the three times overlapping first three windows will look identical to that now save your pending changes and close that window now you're not going to see the single single plow anymore because I deleted those sections for editing to make this shorter. So you go to the first sex, first line and you go over two on this one. First one you went up in the corner, the second one you went over one, the third one you go over two, just like in three times overlapping. Once again, you won't see me saving pending changes, or you might, yeah, you'll see the saving pending changes. You won't see the uh, single crop anymore. On the fourth farm, you start out back in the corner, but you go down one this time instead of over. You go down one. And plow all that. And then you save your pending changes and close that window. You start it from the edge there. Down one and at the edge for the fourth farm. On the fifth farm, you would start, you go down one, and then over one. Complete that row. Now you notice we're right on the edge of the farm here, so on the next one we're going to have to go, instead of using our 4x4, four four, we're going to have to go down to the 3x3 three three because we won't have enough room for our four fields on the next line there. But anyway, so on the sixth farm, what you're going to do is you go down one, down one, and then over two, and that's your second line of, of fields. 
So you have three going across, and then you're going to have three lines going down. Then that gives you three by three or nine. <laughs> On the seventh farm, you start back over at the edge again. And you go down two this time, but as you see, the four by four won't fit because there's not enough room left on the edge of the farm there for that last row. So we're going to switch this over to the uh, three by three. See how it doesn't fit down there? We can't go down two. So we're going to go to the three by three, start in the corner, and still go down two. And stay across the edge because this is your seventh farm. Down two and start from there. And save your pending changes and close that window. See, there wasn't enough room down there. So pending changes. Close the window. We're going to stay on the with the nine by nine, or the times nine, three by three plow tool. Now this time you're going to go down two, one, two, and then over one. Say pending changes, close that window. We're on the ninth, ninth tab now. You go down two and over two for the last one. Down two, over two. And that's your last tab. At the end of this one, you'll do your pending, save, save your pending changes, and then you'll go up and refresh the game. Not just go to a different farm, but actually refresh the whole browser window. <laughs> Excuse my cold, by the way. Okay, and now we're going to go down here, and this is your 9x9. Nine nine. Very small squares, because you only see one ninth of each field, except for around the edges. Now... I had a few here that didn't take quite well, and so instead of redoing it, I'm just going to let that be for now. If you wanted to fix that, you'd have to redo the whole farm. Now I'm showing my fences here, and around the edges, I'm going to clean up now and take the bulldozer, and I'm just going to click on the ones that I don't want to stick out from over the fence line there. And then we'll go down. We'll do a few here. And that's how you keep your farms nice and neat. Have fun all, and happy farming.